it's Monday morning, April 19th, 2021. I'm in my Superliner Roomette on the northbound city of New Orleans, headed from the Big Easy, New Orleans, back to Chi-Town, Chicago, Illinois. It's about uh, 6.35 a.m. We're south of uh, Effingham, Illinois, running about two hours late due to major Canadian national freight train interference north of Memphis, Tennessee. And here's my breakfast that Jean, my sleeping car attendant, just brought me from the dining car. Uh, breakfast omelet and coffee. Uh, we're out, he's out of Diet Coke, which I also ordered. And we're coming up, speeding up the main line of Mid-America, the former Illinois Central, then Illinois Central Golf, now Canadian National Railway. We're running about two hours late due to major freight train, Canadian National Railway freight train interference north of Memphis, Tennessee. Speeding up the main line of Mid-America at the legal 79 miles an hour. At one point, we were going to 83 miles an hour during the night. We have one Brand X GE, General Electric Locomotive, these two Superliner sleeping cars. I'm in the second one. And then we have a dining car, which is not uh, open to passengers. Uh, the meals are brought to uh, the roomettes. And we have a Superliner Sightseer Lounge Car. We have two Superliner Coaches bringing up the rear. We have a Superliner Combination Coach Baggage Car departing New Orleans, the Big Easy. We had 153 passengers, a good crowd according to our conductor. And uh, 153 passengers, and of which included over 40 in the two sleepers. The Big Easy is alive and well. Bourbon Street was almost too crowded to walk down the street. Everything opened up in the Big Easy Easter Day. And uh, now all the bars and restaurants and jazz clubs are open to 1 a.m. every night. Just full of tourists. Alive and well. That's my radio scanner we're looking at right now. Hear that whistle blow. The romance of the rails is alive and well, I'm happy to say, aboard Amtrak's northbound city of New Orleans, riding on the city of New Orleans.
Canadian National really has their roadbed in good shape. Uh, very smooth ride all the way from the Big Easy so far. There's a bed on the uh, an upper bed also. Canadian National Talking Hot Box Detector just said we're doing 79 miles per hour, the legal limit. Gave the temperature, the number of wheels, or number of axles, mile post location.
we may be approaching Effingham, Illinois. We'll pound over the diamonds of the former Pennsylvania Railroad main line to St. Louis, now CSX. Right now it's 6.50 a.m. 6 Monday morning, April 19th, 2021. Yeah, I think this is Effingham. We're going to be pounding over the CSX diamonds here soon. Yeah, that water tank says Effingham. Gene, my sleeping car attendants worked for Amtrak for 11 years. the CSX diamond they're lined to uh, St. Louis now we're making our stop at Effingham, Illinois we're still running about two hours late We were due at Effingham at 4.57 a.m. and it's now almost 7 a.m. High ball Effingham, says our conductor. High ball Effingham. High ball Effingham headed for the Chi town
This is the real America. You don't see this from an interstate highway or 30,000 feet above. Here you on, am on passenger trains, you see the heart of America. Here's my ticket to ride. Well, it's just about 7 a.m. Monday morning, April 19th, 2021. Now I'm gonna enjoy my coffee and my breakfast omelet over and 